Assalamu alaikum students, this is Farwa Badul, your O-level computer science instructor and welcome to another video. In this video, we will be doing question number 3 of activity 10.3. You can see over here, question says that produce a logic expression, a logic circuit from the following truth table. A truth table is given to you. By using this truth table, you have to produce a logic expression and a logic circuit. So, let's do part 1. Let me quickly write it over here. In part 1, we have to produce a logic expression. Okay. Okay. The first step is, remember that in order to produce a logic expression from a truth table, you have to consider only those rows that has a value 1 in its output. Look here. The output must be 1. You have to consider only those rows. So in my truth table, there are two rows in which the output x is 1. So what you will be doing, in the first row, the value of a is 0 and the value of b is also 0. So remember that if the value of input is 0, you have to write it with not, not a. Similarly, you will write not b. And then you have to join both the inputs with an AND gate. So the expression for row 1 is. Row 1, the expression will be NOT A AND with NOT, sorry for this, NOT B. This is for row 1. Similarly, for row 2, what you will be doing for row 2 or I can write row 4 actually in my truth table. In row 4, the output is 1. So, we will see the values of inputs A and B. So, A is 1 here and B is 1 here. So, it means in the logic expression, you will be writing A and B only. There is no need to write not with any of these inputs and remember that the Inputs will be joined with AND operator or AND logic gate. So, this is what we have got here. Raw 1 got logic expression this, not A and not B. And raw 4 got A and B. Now, once you are done with both the expressions of rows, now you have to combine them combine both of these expressions with an OR gate. So the final logic expression will be, let's write down final here. The final expression will be, write down for row 1, not A and not B. Row 1 will be joined with row 4 and the row 4 is logic expression is A and B. So this is how you are going to find out the logic expression from a given truth table. I'm again, again repeating, you have to consider only those rows in which the output value is 1. And for each of these rows, you have to find out individual logic expression first. For this, if the value of A and B are 0, you have to consider or write it with a NOT, as in row 1. The value of A is 0 and value of B is 0. So, we are writing it as NOT A, NOT B. And then it will be combined with AND logic gate. So, it becomes NOT A and NOT B for row 1. And for row 4, since the value of inputs are 1, 1, so A will be written as it is and B will be written as it is and they will be joined with AND operator. You have to join the inputs with AND operator, which is fixed. Then, finally, you have to combine the logic expressions of each of these rows through an OR operator or OR logic gate. So, look at here. This is row 1 that has input output value 1 and this was row 4 that had output value 1. You combine both the expressions through an 
or gate so this is your final logic expression now the next part is to find out the logic circuit it's pretty easy let's draw the logic circuit of this okay to find out the logic circuit first you have to see that how many input inputs are there so look at here the inputs are only two a and b there are two input lines that will be drawn for the logic circuit now let's do it for these two inner brackets first the first bracket says that it is not a and not b it means there is a not with a to get this not a you have to pass input a through an inverter so it becomes not a same goes with not b it becomes not b now since you got not a and not b you have to combine it through an and gate so both of these inputs will pass through an and gate in order to find out the first bracket so it becomes not a and not b we found the first bracket now let's work for the next bracket the second bracket is a and b so you will take another wire that gives you a and you will also take another wire from b so it will be input b both of these inputs are connected through and gate look at your logic expression so make another and gate here this and gate is simply giving you a and b and finally once you get the inner brackets the values of the inner brackets now join both of them with an or gate so it means you will join both of these lines pass them through an or gate to get your final result so at the output we can simply write it is not a and not b or with a and b this is how you have to make so we are done with logic circuit we are done with logic expression thank you so much for watching the video this is how you have to solve question number 3 of activity 10.3 stay tuned to see, stay connected for question number 4 in the next video bye bye